Hey, what's up guys? In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to create a lock on certain notes or all your notes, depending on what you want. So now if I head on over to my notes and you can see on the side, on the left side, I have some unlocked notes there. And basically I've already put a password on these notes. Now if I click on that lock all the way on the top right, which you might not have yet, I'm going to be showing you how to get that. You can see that now I have a lock on this now, if I wanted to view the note, I can either type in the password that I put in before, or I can just tap my finger on there and the note would automatically reveal itself. Now, in order to get that lock there, as you can see, I don't have it on the topmost note. I'd basically click on my note that I want to create a lock, click on that box with a upward facing arrow right there. And now I would click on lock, lock note right there, right on top of cancel. So I would click on lock note. Now my lock has been added, but it's still not locked yet. Now in order for me to lock it, I would basically click on the lock. And now as you can see, there is a lock. And because I've already put in a password, which I will be showing you very soon, I now have a lock on there. So I can either type in my password or just tap on, sorry, tap on the um, fingerprint reader and it should reveal my note. So now that's pretty much how you add the lock. Now in order for you, in order to create a password for this lock, basically it might even ask you right then and there to create a password, but because I've already set my password, it's not asking me. So now basically you want to head on over to settings. So now once you're in settings, you're basically going to scroll over to notes, scroll down to notes and within notes, you're basically going to see all this stuff right here and you're going to go into password. Now in password, you're gonna have a bunch of options. You're gonna have use touch ID, change password, or reset password. Now, if you click on reset password, all it does is it resets the default password that's already in the system for the notes. So when you click on that lock screen, when you click on the top right corner of the lock, all it does is it changes that default password within your notes. It does not change the password that you've already created for your previous notes. So all those are still existing and you'll need to remember them. Now, in order to change the password for all your passwords, you're basically going to need to remember your old password. So now my old password, I believe was test one. That was the password that I created. And now for my new password, let's type in one, 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 one. And we'll verify that with one, 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 one. And let's hint it out as one, 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 one. And then we'll do done. And now that new password is cre was created. So now if I head on over to notes and I click on notes, and as you can see, if I click on view note and type in one, 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 click okay. It's going to basically reveal the note to me. It's going to unlock the note. And you'll always have to remember to lock the note again because it, it doesn't do it automatically. Now I wish they did that, that it would lock after like say five minutes or something, or you can basically set a timer for that, but they don't have that option, yet, at least not to my knowledge. So let me go ahead and retype that password in. Now for, for, for some reason, it's also not giving me the touch ID. Maybe I need to reinitiate it, but that's basically how you add a password to your notes. So guys, that is going to be it. Hope this video did help you out. If it did, leave a like. Thanks for watching, and until next time, I'll catch you guys on the flip side.